Good morning, and thank you for tuning in to your daily operations weather brief for Wednesday, April 11th. We're seeing some partly cloudy skies out there this morning, and it, it is a cold morning out there. We had temperatures drop uh, below freezing across many parts of the Delmarva this morning. But we do anticipate today just to be uh, a couple degrees below average, and then we are going to be seeing quite a warm-up starting tomorrow. Taking a look at our service analysis this morning, we have high pressure building in just over the mid-Atlantic and that helped to give us some mostly clear skies last night as well as some calm winds which contributed to some good radiational cooling this morning so that helped give us a morning temperature about 10 degrees below average in many spots across the region this morning so uh, it is was rather cold we are seeing temperatures warm up nicely though uh, back to more normal levels as of the 8 a.m. hour we do got a low pressure well to the south there. That's not going to have really any impact on the weather at all today. But we are having um, some cloudiness move in from the west around that 8,000 foot level this morning as we have an upper level trough axis moving overhead. So that is going to give us um, a little bit of uptick in cloudiness as we go for the early afternoon hours. Sorry about that. Taking a look at our satellite and radar loop this morning. We're having uh, light and variable winds as high pressure is in control. Our winds are going to be really um, controlled by some uh, weak sea breezes today, so we are expecting those winds to uh, whip around between the north and south as we go through uh, the morning hours into the afternoon, and then they will become south-southwesterly and increase a bit to 8 to 13 hours by the mid-afternoon hours and into the uh, evening as that high pressure begins to shift offshore and give us that uh, southerly flow that is expected to increase as we go into tonight and into tomorrow, ushering in that warmer air mass. As of 8 a.m., we were seeing a scatter deck near 8,000 feet and a scatter deck near 25,000 feet. Winds were very light, just from the northeast at 3 knots, but like I said, they are going to be whipping around um, very light this morning. Um, and we are seeing a temperature at 8 a.m. of 40 degrees. Taking a look at our weather hazards for today, we are going to be clear of any weather hazards. Temperature is going to be just a couple degrees below normal, around 56 today. As you can see, those winds are expected to be variable and fairly light through the morning hours and into um, lunchtime. And then as we go into the mid to late afternoon hours, we'll see those winds increase from the south-southwest to around 7 to 12 knots. And they will remain south-southwesterly at around 5 to 10 knots throughout the overnight hours. And then we are expecting them to increase and become uh, rather gusty as we go into the mid to late morning hours on Thursday. We are going to be looking at a more mild low tomorrow morning of 43 as that high pressure moves off east of the area and we get a bit of a more warmer southerly flow. Taking a look at our terminal forecast for today, we're going to be looking uh, just at those mid-level clouds, mainly a scattered deck, and that deck is expected to become broken as we go close to the lunchtime hour uh, near 6,000 feet and we will be seeing a little bit of a cirrus deck at the 25,000 foot level as well. Those uh, mid-level clouds should clear out um, as we get just before sunset at around uh, 5 or 6 p.m. this evening and then just becoming a few at 25,000 feet for the late evening hours. And then towards midnight, it does look like we are going to be seeing some more mid-level clouds near 7,500 or between 7,500 and 9,000 feet moving to the area between midnight and 8 a.m. with possibly even a deck near 15,000, um, a few at... 8 a.m. tomorrow morning. For the next few days, we are going to be seeing that warm-up start across the area. Tomorrow, we are looking at a partly cloudy day with a warmer high of 68. It is going to be breezy as that high pressure uh, strengthens to the south of the area and a low moves across the Great Lakes, really uh, increasing that pressure gradient across the Wallops region. So we are expecting a, a wind advisory tomorrow. For Thursday night, still expecting uh, some breezy winds at times, especially early, but we are going to be seeing a very mild low of 53 as that south to southwesterly flow really establishes itself across the region. And then Friday is going to be a very warm day for this time of year with a high of 74 expected. Could even be seeing temperatures uh, a little bit more than that if we get those winds to become a little bit more southwesterly versus southerly for Friday. Still going to be slightly breezy as we have a um, bit, bit of a tight pressure gradient over the area under partly cloudy skies. That'll do it for Daily Operations Weather Brief. We'll be back at 10 a.m. for your full weather briefing and extended outlook. Have a great day.